I almost like digging as much as I like riding. I, I love creating stuff and I'm, I'm so passionate about digging. I don't really know what it is, but uh, I think about stuff I want to build and dig all the time. I have a book at home and so, sometimes I wake up in the middle of the night and I'm like, oh, I have an idea and I have to like draw it down. I just love being out there, like out in the woods, uh, lifting logs, digging, and it, it just gives me a really good feeling. I also look at digging as kind of as an art. I, I love just spending so much time getting the right dirt, Dude. getting the, the nice edges. It, it, it kind of maybe sounds strange for other people, but uh, I just put everything into it and I just love it. I dig with a small group of friends and uh, we fire each other up and we're, we're almost like animals out in the woods. <laughs> so you can see under, it's like this. And it's like perfect good dirt in there. This is like really nerdy stuff. <laughs> yeah, dirt nerd. Hey, I'm Drago Westavik, I'm 22 years old and I'm a mountain biker. Bikes has always been a part of my life and uh, my dad was really into it so I guess it's through my dad but I, I, I just been riding bikes my whole life. When I was younger we didn't really go to any normal holiday so we, we always went to bike trips. I can't remember going to a normal like holiday on a beach. We've been, like every weekend has been like riding and biking and I can't thank him, and him enough and he's still like a big part of what I do like for example during this video project in the winter he was like joining me digging helping me the filming days and and it's not not just because he want to help me it's, it's just because he really loves it as well most of the time I, I just like to ride and let my body do it itself like one of the best feelings is to, to just ride and don't plan what to do just let your body do the rest I'm actually watching a lot of skiing, skating, BMX and I feel like my riding is really inspired by those disciplines as well. Sometimes I build stuff especially for, for what I've seen in a video, like I can put a log up and try grind the log. If I'm scared to try something when, when I'm out filming with my friends and stuff, they call me a coward or, or they call me like, just do it or you're a coward and, and then I like kind of get like fired up and, and do it, but everyone is different there. But uh, I kind of like that little pressure a bit. That's how I, I push myself further. I have been a huge fan of Extreme Sport Veco since I was a kid. I, I was at Extreme Sport Veco with my family, lived at the, at the camp every year, like maybe like almost like 10 years in a row and I've, I've had so many sick experiences from there just hanging at, at the camp meeting meeting other extreme sport uh, people like kayak people skydiving people it's just so cool to see everyone at one place and experience other type of sports and uh, I remember one of the coolest competitions I've done is Horigi uh, Ned where you where you team up with a skier and a kayaker and the skier goes down the mountain and meets you with the vest and gives it to me and I ride down the mountain and gives it to the kayaker and that's like some of the sickest experiences from my life and uh, I think it's, it's really cool that everyone meets at one place and, and do their thing and experience each other. Uh, downhill is more the like extreme part of mountain biking. It's just about, it's in the name, it's just about going down. You can do bigger stuff on the downhill bike, more terrain, more rocks more routes, bigger jumps, bigger sends. I love downhill, I, I do a lot of downhill riding. Free ride is more about just being free and being yourself. Do what you want, kinda. From doing, you can do competitions if you want, you can do video parts, 
you can build a sick line. You're just free to do your own thing, yeah. Enduro is more up and down. I like to call it trail biking. It's like uh, enduro is more the, just uh, the competition form. I think the trail bike is what I use the most. I can almost call a trail bike a mountain bike. That's like a bike for everything. You can go as easy up as down, kind of, yeah. Dirt slash BMX is on a smaller bike, almost with no suspension. It's uh, made for like smoother tracks, uh, often like kind of flat with like dirt jumps. You can go in the streets. It's more tricks in dirt jumping. But I feel like all the disciplines is inspired by each other. I think like in free riding, you, you get inspired by tricks they do in dirt jumping. In dirt jumping, you, you get inspired by free riding by doing drops in downhill riding on the trails. You, I feel like everyone gets inspired by everyone. I feel like mountain biking is so much about having fun as well. There is not too many riders that's just all about competition. I feel like everyone is trying out all the different disciplines and there's a really cool scene in, in mountain biking. <laughs> I think the goal is just to push the limit and where the limit is, it's hard to tell, but uh, just go further, yeah. Yeah, maybe my mom is re regular holidays. Yeah, I think so. <laughs> yeah.